Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Tips and Tricks from Boggy. Today I will share with you all how to stretch your fingers and hands after a practice session. So the first thing we are going to do is to warm up a little bit your hand by massaging with circles your palm and your fingers. So open your hand wide and then close it and do it five times at least. Then after, make a flow. Again, do it at least five times. Then after, bend your fingers straight. Now you can see that this is very difficult for me because I think it's because of the violin, how I play. It's just never going to be straight, but I try my best. And then you can just stretch fingers like this and shake it up, of course. Okay, the next, next thing is we are going to stretch the arm here by pulling the hand backwards very gently. You have to be very careful. And then after, we are going to do one by one. And by the way, this was recommended by a doctor. I'm not just saying it. You can pull it, pull your fingers back for like five seconds. You could do it for 10 seconds, but don't really do it more than that, because that will be too much. And of course, shake your cuff, not to hurt yourself. Okay, next one. Now we are going to stretch the upper side of the forearm by pulling gently your hand again backwards. You, you should feel a nice stretch here. And I can, we could do it for like five seconds or 10 seconds. Okay, the next thing we are going to do is lifting the fingers up, nice gently, um, stretch and then tapping the rest of the fingers with each other. You should be very careful not to pull it too hard and too high because then you, could, you can hurt yourself. So and also the tapping just do it very slowly and very gently. Next one, we are going to do little circles in one direction with each fingers and then back. You do it a few times. So my favorite is the ring finger. Just really like to do the circles with that finger. the time. The last exercise is for the wrist, so we are just going to do circles with the hand. And shake it off. Of course you could do it with the right hand as well and you should do it with the right hand as well but I just showed everything with my left hand for now. Before we finish this video I wanted to show you guys my yoga roll but I'm using also to to release any pain and um, tension in my in my arm 
So what I do with this one, just put carefully my violin down. What I do with it is just rolling my arm very gently everywhere. And it's just a really nice stretch at the end of the day when I finish practicing. I always do that and since I'm doing it, I just realized that the next day my hand is just so relaxed and I don't have any tension. I never had any hand injuries or hand pain from the violin and I think it's mainly because of these stretches and exercises I'm doing. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Next week, we are going to talk about how to hold the violins. If you're interested in that video, stay tuned. Bye!